Hey guys, I'm gonna do a, a quick video. Um, I haven't fed them yet, so if you wonder why their food bowls are empty. Uh, real quick, I still have the babies. Um, one of them actually passed away. Uh, I think it's because the other ones were bowling it out of its food, and I didn't notice soon enough. Um, but there's now seven of them, and there's actually five boys and, or, I'm sorry, five girls and two boys. Uh, and the rest of them are doing okay. I'm checking on them every day. Uh, I was actually gone um, for a while camping, so I didn't get to notice sooner. Um, and they'll be ready to go in a couple weeks. Um, anyways, back to what I wanted to show you. Uh, I actually installed, in case you haven't noticed, uh, an automatic watering system. Um, it was actually fairly simple once you kind of got the hang of it. Um, it was maybe like $20 actually in total. Um, okay, maybe 30 um, so I just have a regular bucket, and, uh, the lid just kind of loosely comes on and off. I, uh, sanitized it and cleaned it out and stuff. Um, I drilled a hole into the bucket, and then, um, I don't, I'm trying, I don't remember the exact names for any for everything, so I'm really sorry. Um, but this is essentially, uh, a valve, so it, you can turn the water off or on. Um, and then this is, um like the same kind of stuff that you would use like on a shower drain to keep it from leaking everywhere uh, so the water doesn't leak and then this I'm gonna go ahead I'm not gonna take it off because I don't want it to go everywhere but on um, this you can actually pull it back and just disconnect it if I wanted to take the bucket down but what I've actually been doing um, is filling it up with a uh, uh, like a watering can for flowers um, and I only fill it up about halfway just because I want the water to stay fresh and so it's easier to clean and take down if I need to. Um, I did clear hose so that if it ever got dirty or moldy I could easily uh, see it and clean it out. Um, and this, um, I'm actually not sure what it is. I got it from my dad. Um, but it's just screwed. Come on camera, focus. Um, but it's just screwed into here. And then, I'm sorry, I won't focus. And then, uh, it's in here and it's not leaking or anything, so. Um, and then I bought about, uh, 20, I bought about 31 feet of clear tubing. And it just about did it exactly. Um, and what I did was I went on Amazon and just looked up automatic rabbit waters. And, um, it came in a pack of 10 where I got these little, um, tea things and the actual uh, rabbit water thing. Now I can go ahead and um, show you real quick how the uh, actual water works. Because the li it's just a little bit different than um, a regular uh, water bottle. Uh, what you do is they're just pull down here and then water you know, flows out of it. Um, and uh, it's really simple. Uh, all of them learn to use it fairly quickly. And I haven't really had any complaints with it. Even uh, the babies can use it. So they've been doing that fine. And, um, uh, what I do to keep it on top of the, um, thing is I just have some, um, metal wires so that if I need to take it down, it's fairly quick and easy instead of, like, stapling it to it or something. Um, but so far it's worked really well. I only need to fill it up really once a week. That's about a five-gallon tub, I think. And, um, even for, this is actually an empty cage right now. Um, I'm hoping to keep one of Excel's babies with Jinx. And, um, but yeah, the, uh, the system is working really nice. And, um, it's a lot easier for me to, so all I have to do is feed them every day. Um, anyways, thanks for watching. Um, if you have any questions, I will try my best to answer. Um, I'm not good with the actual names of the, uh, the tubing and, you know, all the other stuff in it. But um, I can try and help as much as I can. Um, thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Bye.